two, one, go. All right. Totally dark sandstorm. They're using cameras or autonomous. First time in several years, they can actually guide it directly. 15 seconds with three remaining. Blue Line's trying to get a hatch on for extra point two points. Oh, Blue takes an early lead. Red Alliance going in out of the habitat zone, trying to stock up on cargo or hatch panels. Each team can pre-populate the cargo ship with their choice of a hatch panel or cargo. If they didn't put a hatch panel on, cargo ships are built to push out any cargo at the beginning after the sand stop. Two points for cargo, three points for hatch panels. The cargo is a rubber ball, 13 inches in diameter, filled with Primus atmosphere. 973 just loaded on the first level of their rocket ship on the scoring table side. They're, put, they're trying to get a second. They got it too. They got the first level filled up. The Blue Alliance. 6499, the Red Alliance picking up Carborough in the half zone. Coming up to the final minute. Next sandstorm is coming. They got to fill the cargo ship and the rocket ship for lunch and get back to the habitat zone before time runs out. 11, 11, 1160. Oh, their hash panel fell off. The hash panels have white around the edges, and that's really the loop of Velcro that will attach to the black rectangles you see on the hash panels. 10 seconds to the end game, getting back to the habitat zone. There's three levels in the habitat zone. Each level can get you extra points. If you go to the highest level, it's 12 points. Level two is six. Level one is three, or if you get a combination such as 15, it's ranking points with 10 seconds remaining. And all three red just scrambled up. Oh, one's trying to get in. Two, all, all three of blue are up. Two, whoa! Oh, center of gravity took over on the red alliance. 5,500. Getting the signal from Primus takes a while sometimes. Primus is far, far away.